I'd like to show you three more options to tie ribbon around gift boxes. Make one loop and tail with the ribbon on the right side. Fold the point, then put it in the top center of the box. Take the left side ribbon wrap around the box like this. When the left ribbon crosses over the right ribbon on the top of the box, pull the right ribbon to the right and the left ribbon to the lower left. Then wrap the ribbon around the box like this. When the left side ribbon comes back on top, pull out the right side ribbon and push it under the cross point. Pull out the right side ribbon to the upper right. Tighten the knot. Take the left side ribbon and make one loop. With the right side ribbon, make it over the loop, then push into the hole and pull it out to the left. Pull out both loops. When tightening, pull the bottom of the right loop and the top of the left loop. Adjust the position of the wrapped ribbon, then trim the both tails. The first option is done. You can make a horizontal box in the same way. Let's get started the second option. This is the basic way to start making a bow. Make one loop and tail. Hold the point and put it where you want to make a bow. In this case, place it in the center of the box and wrap the ribbon follow the video. The longer left side ribbon crosses over the right side ribbon at the front center. The back of the box should look like this. When longer left side ribbon comes back to the front center, wrap it tightly. Take the right ribbon, make it over and tuck under the cross point. Pull out the right side ribbon, tighten the knot. Make sure at the back of the box, the ribbon should be parallel nicely. Tighten the knot again. Then make a bow as in the first option. Pull out the both loops and adjust the bow. Wrapping ribbon diagonally. Sometimes it loosens easily. You can fix the position by adding double-sided tape under the ribbon on the corner of the box. Trim both tails. Second option is finished. Let's start the third option. As a basic rule, make one loop and tail with ribbon on the right side. Fold the point and let go. In this option, place the point in the top right corner of the box. Wrap the longer ribbon around the back of the box from bottom to top. In front, cross the ribbon on the long side at the point and pull it to the upper left. Bring it back to the front and pull it slightly to the lower left over the point. Make sure the ribbon on the back is flat and parallel. Bring the long side of the ribbon to the front. Pull out the right side ribbon at the cross point. Then tuck under the point from the bottom left corner to the top right corner. Pull it out to upper right corner. Adjust the placement. Tighten the knot. Then make a bow in the same way as the first option. For tightening, pull out the bottom of the right loop and the top of the left loop. Just like the second option, apply double-sided tape to hold the ribbon in place. Make sure the ribbon is neatly wrapped and adjust the bow. Trim the tails. Here you go, the third option. I hope you like additional three options for wrapping ribbons.